Are you playing by yourself? Uh-huh, I'm waiting for my daddy. I see. that we'd come play here together next Sunday. I promised my daddy. That's why I'm waiting here. I'm gonna wait next Sunday, and the Sunday after that, I'm gonna keep on waiting. Huh. It's Nita's daughter. <laughs> Commander Samson! You know what's the matter? Having love problems? It's nothing. Attention, everyone. We've detected a Mao class Digimon. Go to the digital world immediately. Looks like this is the last Mao Digimon. How do you know that? There's only one missing child left. We should be able to find the child with this one. Dax, deploy. Digital dive authorized. <laughs> hey, what's up, guys? Shadow Shack here, and welcome back to you. Digimon World Data Squad. So if you guys are hype, make sure to hit that six like button. That'll be much appreciated. And I really hope that you guys are having a nice day so far. And thank you all so so much for the support through the series. I'm so glad that you guys are enjoying this game because I really really love this game. And we are so close to the end, guys. But for right now, I want to show you guys the team because I've been doing a bit of grinding. So I'm really excited to show you all the grinding I've been doing. So as you can see, Agumon is now level 29, and what is crazy is once you get to level 30, and I believe he's gonna get to level 30 today, so we're gonna be able to go into Shangarimon already, so it's crazy. And also, Gaomon is now level 29, Falcomon 29, Lanomon 29, so they're all level 29, which is pretty cool. I've been grinding a lot, and that was really fun, but anyway guys, now it's time to get to this mission, I guess. I mean, hold up. I wanna see something, because I actually saw something while grinding. That got my attention yet because basically there's a night in where you can actually remove the encounters and stuff like this But I think you can only find them while you in the game or something like in a mission So I guess so because I can see them here So yeah, but basically there's certain items that give you a way to have no encounter So that's pretty dope. But anyway guys, let's just jump into this new map right now Which is called Sea Precipi Jurapulus. I'm really excited to get there because you know we saw that in the cutscene So that's gonna be dope Alright, so here we are guys, so from the start we saw that there's a chest here, so we're gonna go straight for this chest for sure But anyway, what kind of Digimon are we gonna encounter in this area? That's the question. Woo! Who is that Digimon? I've never seen this Digimon before. I mean, I don't recall him. His name is Mambumon. What the swaggy? That's pretty cool, man. He's totally fitting with Gaomon for his glove, you know? They could both box together. But anyway, we just destroyed this little fish guy, so that was funny. So here we go. It's over now. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention that I do have a Gromon now. I mean, a War Gromon, but yellow version. Which I was supposed to switch, but I didn't. But let me go ahead and grab this chest, and I guess I can actually do it right now with you guys, because I don't know, I got so many, like, Digivolution line, but... I kinda wanna wait to show you guys the whole thing, because I don't think it really matters, because my goal for this Let's Play is to actually have all the uh, main Digimon uh, from Data Squad, you know, last Digivolution. So basically here with uh, this guy, with Falcomon, I want this guy, you know? So we need to fight 3 Mega and fight uh, defeat 5 Wing Digimon for their last requirements. So for the next battle, I believe, I, will, I mean, the next uh, Mega battle, I will make sure to let uh, Falcomon defeat this guy, so we can get an extra Mega Digimon uh, you know, monster defeated, so we can get this Digivolution soon. But anyway, we gotta keep moving on, guys. We gotta go ahead and go this and follow the path, I guess. So there's nothing on the right, so we're not gonna go to the right, you know. So we're gonna go to the left. But before that, we need to get into a battle, my friend. Another one. God damn, there's so many of those guys. Those Memboman. And they're so easy to defeat. We can actually one-shot <laughs> one them, which is cool. And also, we got all in Kanan. I don't think you guys seen it before, so... Yeah. Alright, so that's gonna be our turn. Let's go. Bam. 
Blackout. Boom. Alright, so we've done it, guys. That was easy. Alright, so now we're gonna go ahead and activate this red switch so we can move on to the next location. So let's go. I guess this is it. There we go. I think that's pretty cool that the switch move on all that stuff. I don't know, I think it's really cool, guys. Alright, so now let's go. Damn it. Ooh, alright, alright, some Shamamon, I believe. Alright, let's defeat them. There's so many cool Digimon in here. But we gotta destroy this guy now. Here we go. So, man, we are destroying those Digimon in this area. I think that's pretty cool. I really think it is cool. Alright, so now it's our turn again. Let's go, Shamamon. I need to destroy your butt right now. Spiritual kick. Alright, I didn't do too much, but it's cool, though. So now, is it Shiny Grimmon third? Not yet. Yeah, it's crazy, because Shiny Grimmon really don't add that much often, so it's really hard for me to uh, level up Shiny Grimmon, because, I mean, not Shiny Grimmon, Rise Grimmon, or Agumon, I should say, because then, all my other Digimon will attack first, so it's crazy. But anyway, here we go, it's done. So now we gotta keep moving on, and go there, and get to this next area, guys. So yeah, here we go. So now we're gonna head to the second floor of this map, guys. So yeah. Alright, so here we are. There's a chest up there that we really want to get, so we're surely going to get that. Alright, but anyway, are we going to encounter the same Digimon again? Ooh, I can't believe there's that. No way. Some a black Greymon in here. I mean, blue Greymon. Even more cool. So that's actually pretty cool that there's still Digimon in here. I wasn't expecting that, so. So there's so many verities in here, so it's a good place to grind, I should, I should say. Alright, so now let's destroy the other one. There we go. I don't think we're gonna defeat him from one hit because, you know. You see? That's why. Because I knew it already, guys. Alright, so now we're gonna go ahead and defeat this guy. Alright, so we're just defeating him. We go, go Tornado, which was a crazy move. I really love this move, to be honest, guys. Alright, so let's go. Oh man, we're getting closer and closer to that level 30 with Agumon. I'm so excited. That's gonna be dope to Digivolve. Alright, so now, where should we go? I guess we can go down and see. Okay, there's a red switch, so let's activate it. So now all the platforms are gonna switch. So now we can move on, and we can see the old guy over there, Yoshino. But we're not gonna speak with him. We're gonna speak with him very soon, if you're wondering. Alright, so now we're gonna head up, because, you know, there's not really any other option, right? I mean, I don't think I've seen anything else, so there's a blue switch up there. Alright, so now there's the blue switch up there, and there's a chest over there. So we're gonna go ahead and get this chest real quick, guys, so here we go. Let me get this chest, so we got the open command, awesome. So like I mentioned, I'm not gonna talk to this guy until we are mostly done, you know? So you'll see. Alright, so let's go ahead and activate this blue switch, so here we go. So now... Oh, there's a chest over there that I missed on. Can I just do that? Alright, so how do I get there anyways? I don't think I can get there, so let's not worry about this chest for right now. Because from what I'm seeing, I don't think there's any way to get there, guys. So, anyway, let's go ahead and get in here. Alright, so now we're going down and we turning. Alright, so I guess for right now, we cannot go ahead and get this chest. But I believe we're going to be able to get it later on, guys. So from what I'm saying, we could save over there, right? Yes, but we're not gonna save yet. I don't think it's really worth it to save, so we're not going to do it. But anyway, here we are now in the floor number three. So that's pretty cool, right? That we are here right now. So we're just gonna follow the path because we can't really do anything else. So there's a switch. Should we activate the switch? What? Oh my god, there's a woman in here. I wasn't expecting this at all, guys. Oh my god, but it's so tiny. One man's like a giant Digimon normally. If you guys ever watch Digimon Adventure, you can see how tall he is. It's a freaking little worm on right now. That's so weird to see that. Like, you know, you don't usually see this in, in action, you know what I mean? But anyway, here we go. We just turned this guy into a Digi Egg, right? Now, because, you know, that's our ability, which I really love this ability. And we're getting so close to that next level. Oh man, I'm so excited. But anyway. We are actually gonna skip the red uh, switch for right now, guys, but we're gonna activate it later on, and you'll see why. So now we have two pads, but if we go up, we can get a chest, so we're gonna go ahead and grab this chest. So by doing so, we got an internal courage, right? That's how you say it, right? 
So here we go. Alright, so now we're gonna go ahead and go down once again. No. Damn it. Oh, what the swag. I wasn't expecting to see three Mega Sijamon in here. Oh my god. There's so many cool Digimon in here, but they are so scary. I just hope that we can kick your butt because, man, three Mega Sijamon is not just one, it's three. Jesus Christ, this is scary. Alright, and by the way, is, hold up, hold the phone. Uh, Mega Sijamon, I believe uh, Mega Sijamon is an ultimate, right? He's not a Mega. Oh my god, I can't remember. But anyway, we're gonna destroy this guy, and I believe we're gonna get a nice level after this, guys. But I'm actually gonna check it out, right? We are fighting this guy, and I'll let you know, guys, because I always get confused with those. So basically, Mega Sejumon is an ultimate Digimon. Damn it, I was hoping for him to be Mega, but I knew he wasn't Mega, because we want to remember. But anyway, we just destroyed this Mega Sejumon, so that's dope. That's really dope. Alright. So now, what are you doing, Mega Sejumon? Thunder Javelin? Alright. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That does nothing to be honest, so why should I be scared? Oh, we can Digistool. Ooh, what kind of Digimon can we get? Let's go. Digistool, my friend. I'm actually really excited because I don't know. I hope it's something dope. Come on, it better be something dope. Come on, Cryer. Give me something awesome. Alright, let's see. Who's that? Is that Otomamon? It is. Oh, damn it. Not that cool. I mean, it's, it's a rookie Digimon, so that's why I'm not too impressed. I was hoping to get something better. But for right now, I can't really do anything, so I'm gonna stick with this guy for this battle. So let's go, Child Cloud. That does nothing. <laughs> it's okay, though. Alright, let's go. Let's destroy this Mega Sidramon now. But for, uh, for um, what are we gonna do now, guys? Is we're basically gonna go ahead and activate the red switch. So the reason we went up is it was to get the chest. But now that we've done it, we're just gonna go ahead and activate the red switch so we can move on. So yeah, just so you guys know. All right, so here we go. All right, so now let's go ahead and head back and activate the red switch and see where what this is gonna activate. So as you can see, we can now head to the elevator. So we're gonna go ahead and skip the blue line for right now, but we'll head back there later on. Oh my God! So we just level up, guys. So here we go, man. I'm actually really happy because now that we level up, we can Digimon with two Shine Gremon, and I can finally say Shine Gremon and not messed up, you know? Because I always messed up when I say uh, Shine Gremon because you know we have Rise Gremon and stuff. But anyway. We're gonna go ahead and head up, and the reason so is because we're gonna move on to floor number four, and by doing so, we're gonna be able to get two amazing chests, one on the left and one on the right, as you can see. So that's basically for that. But anyway, here we go. We're gonna do this battle together because, man, I'm excited to Digivolve. God damn! All right, so I can't really destroy this Digimon right now because if I do, I can't Digivolve. So, all right, here we go. Shine Gremon. I mean, Rise Gremon. Very soon, I can say Shine Gremon. But anyway, here we go. Please, Shine Gremon, be your turn now. Oh my god, I need to switch this guy. I totally forgot about this again. I always forget. But I need to remember after this battle. Because I don't know why I forget. Alright, come on, Chang Grimond. Damn it. Why is it so fast? Like, I, I don't have an issue for him to be fast. But the thing is, I already won Rise Grimond to find a Digivolve, you know? Oh man, it's finally time to get Chang Grimond, guys. Let's go. Oh my god, this is gonna be your strongest Digimon. <laughs> Let's go, man. Take that. Here we go, 300 damage, man, Marcus is getting stronger also, man, let's go. It's time, man. It's so amazing, because now we are into a last form. Man, this music's always so hype, man. But here we go, guys. Shangrimon in the building. Holy God, look at him. <laughs> you look so damn cool. All right, let's go. Let's destroy Mon Boom Mon right now. Show me what you made of. Glorious burst. Oh, that was crazy. Here we go. Woo! That did a lot of damage, guys. I'm so impressed. I'm sorry, man. Oh god, I can't believe that we have Shine Grimon right here. Oh my god, this is inc okay. Real quick, I need to do the switching right now. Let me do it.
Also, also, before I do that, I want to show you guys what you need to get this guy, so you can see the requirements right here. So those are the requirements to um, get Shine Greymon, just so y'all know. So maybe some of you are wondering while watching this, so just so y'all know. And I was actually trying to get this guy, War Greymon, but it's pretty hard to get him because you need to defeat so many kind of Digimon, which I did a, a few, but I still want to get him. And I really want to get this guy here, War Greymon X, I believe, or something like that. So I really want to get this guy in the future, maybe, or something, or Omnimon. You know, those are some Digimon that I really, really want to get at a certain point. But those are really the main Digimon I want to get from those, uh, this galaxy. But anyway, let's go ahead and go back to this guy here. So hopefully those two will Digimon too soon, you know, Gaomon and Falcomon to your last form. Because, you know, we want to see those guys in action as well. Alright, but I just hope that Shangerman is faster now, to be honest. Alright, so let's go. We got some money, I believe. And now, what are we going to get here? M HP. Oh, we're getting into a battle. Damn it. But it's okay because I really want to do this battle just because I want to see. Oh, snap. Okay. Again. Again, three of those guys. Damn it, man. Those were something, man. Alright. Let's go. Winning straight. I should not. Like, sometimes I kind of want to skip the battles, right? But I'm not doing it because if I do so, then, you know, uh, some of the requirements will take longer, so it's just better to just fight everything so you don't see the time just going with that. You know what I mean, guys? Hard to explain, but basically... Oh my god, that did so much damage! But I think it's just better to fight every single match so you can get some experience, plus you can get some uh, requirements by doing so, so... That's why I'm doing all the battle, if you're wondering. But anyway, here we go. Alright. Alright, so now, next battle... Let's go, Shangri-Man. Show me what you made of. I knew you gotta destroy this guy because he's almost dead. Ooh, Shine Hammer. That's dope. Let's go. Alright, let's go, let's go. I'm just too happy right now. This is just too awesome to have this guy, to be honest. There's nothing to say about it, just because it's too nice. Alright, so now we are moving back to floor number 3, if you guys are wondering. So now, uh, that we're back in here... Uh, we need to add back to the blue switch, I believe, so yeah. But I'm actually curious to see what is in here. Alright, so what is in here, real quick? Alright, there's a chest. Well, I'm glad that I went here, actually. I wasn't expecting to get that for some reason, I don't know. But anyway, there's the blue switch, shall I activate it? Alright, so we're actually not gonna activate it yet, but, you know, by doing so, we just got a chest, so that's really dope. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and head back down. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and activate back the red switch, guys. Here we go, so that's what we did. So now that we've done that, so, uh, what we're gonna do next now is we're gonna keep heading left and go back to the old elevator. And you'll see why, just in a moment. It's really confusing in here, just so you know. Alright, so let's keep heading left and head back to here. So here we go, guys. We're moving back to floor number... what is it? I'm trying to remember. Floor number two, right? Alright, so here we are back in here, guys. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna head up. Head to Yoshina. Alright, so let's go. Let's set up and then go down once again. So yeah, guys, we're doing some move back and all. Alright, so if you're wondering why we are doing this, basically it's for those two chests. I mean, you see one over there, guys, but there's another chest if we follow the path. So we're basically going for those chests right now. So yeah. Alright, so the first one is right here. So here we go, guys. One free chest. Pretty easy, right? Again, the other one should be on the left, if I remember correctly. Alright, so now, I believe it's down there. Is it? No, it's not. Uh, is it the other way? Damn, I, I think we already got it. Alright, so let's just head back to the floor number 3 real quick. Alright guys, so as you can see, we are back in here in floor number 3. And the reason we were here, it was pretty easy, was just to activate this blue switch. Because we didn't do it at first, but now that we've done that, guys, we're gonna head back down, so yeah. Alright, so we're back in here, so if you guys remember, you know, we could not go this path, and I was like, wondering, how could we get this chest, right? So here we go, we got a Resist DS by doing so. And I don't really care about what we get in the chest, because mostly I just want it for the requirements for certain Digivolution, to be honest with y'all, so, yeah. But anyway, here we are now, in the next floor, which I believe it's 3F, so now we are back in here, guys, so... Now that we are here, let's go ahead and explore this area. Alright, so let's follow this path right now, so should we activate the blue switch? That's the question, guys, right now. Let me know. No, I'm kidding. Uh, I'm trying to think right now. 
Okay, let's just activate it and see what's going to happen. Well, it will make us go to a new elevator, so sure. But before we do so, I'm actually gonna get this chest over there and go to the right and see what is over there because I'm wondering. Alright, so now that we have two ways to go, I think we should just go up and see what is over there. And if there's like a lot of stuff, we're not gonna go there yet and we're gonna check out the other one that we just activate, guys. So let's see here. Well, this seems like the end, so we're not gonna go there yet, trust me. Because from what I'm seeing right now, this like gate, this weird gate that we set at the end, seems like the right path. So, what we actually gotta do right now is we're gonna head to the other one and see what we can get over there. I believe there's chests. Yeah, there's chests. I'm pretty sure there's chests over there. So, we're gonna go ahead and get those chests real quick, guys. If they are chests. But I'm pretty sure they are chests. Here, let's see. Alright, so let's go to the left real quick. Here we go, there's a chest. And I believe there's another chest. I knew it! There were chests in here. I don't know why, but I had a feeling, guys. Alright, so let's get this chest, and now what we're gonna do, guys, is we're, uh, we're basically gonna head back to where we just went, so let's go. Alright, so here we are, guys, so I think we should save. Let's just be honest, we're gonna save, we're not taking any chance. So here we go. Let me go ahead and create a new one, can I? Oh, I can't. Alright, so let me just go back to our old one, level 22, right? Here we go. Just in case that anything happened, we never know, guys. So make sure to always have, like, a lot of safe data just to be secure about, you know, your data and all that stuff. But here we go, we just saved. So now that we've done it, let's keep moving. There's a chest. So like I was trying to say, guys, there's a chest over there. But before we go there, I don't know if this is diary or anything, so I'm just gonna make sure and start healing up my team. Make sure to do so if you're at this point. And wondering so here we go guys we're gonna start healing everybody bam all right so now we are ready we are set for this battle all right here we go Alright, so now we are going Angus Livymon, my friend. And that's gonna be funny. And I, I like how Lanamon said, yo, try to talk to Livymon, because you're a gator as well, you know? Like, what the swag? Come on now. He, I think he just wanna eat us, and I think he's totally right. So now what we're gonna do here, guys, is we're gonna set up real quick. So, from the start, what we're gonna use is go into our items, actually. And we're gonna do something similar that we did in the few battles recently. So, we're gonna go ahead and use a VP Enchant, which I need to find right now. For this battle and we're gonna give it to our stronger Digimon which is Shangarimon now so let's go ahead and give a VB enchant to this guy right here so now by doing so the fight is gonna be a little easier like always every time we use that that just made the battle easier guys right and we're gonna be careful in this battle this time because right uh, what we don't want to do guys is basically we don't want Shangarimon to defeat Leviamon because we need some requirements for the other Digimon that we have on our, uh, on our party so we can actually dissolve them as well because they need to defeat some Mega and Levimon is a mega Digimon guy, so as you can see we did like no damage, which is kind of scary, right? It's scary right now, but it's okay guys, holy canon. 588. That's nothing, but this battle should be easier than the Levimon battle. I mean not uh, Levimon, Bizzlemon I should say guys, so depending on how much we do right now, it will depend if I'm actually gonna use a double uh, attack thing. Well, we did 2,474 damage, which is crazy. Imagine if I use an attack, uh, a double attack right now, how much we'll do. So I think I'm actually gonna do this, guys, so we can do even more damage. So we're just gonna believe in Shangarimon right now. So here, we can use an ultimate drive uh, on this guy here. Yeah, it's not gonna work. I forgot he's Omega now. So for right now, I'm just gonna attack. There's nothing else we can really do. I mean, we could do more sting, but you know, I think it's cool like this right now. It's just, you know, it's a bit of damage. Damage is damage, that's all that matters. Alright, so for right now here, we're just gonna attack. So, I think the Digimon that is gonna finish this guy off is gonna be Falcomon, guys. So, yeah, I'm just saying. I'm not sure for right now, because I can't recall who actually defeated some Mega. But anyway, we're gonna go ahead and use this right here, the Attack Power X2. So now the attack's double, so we should do around 5,000 damage in the next hit. So, 
Crazy, right? Alright, here we go. I'm trying to see if I can do anything here. Uh, we could weak the attack of Leviumon, but he doesn't do too much damage. It's not already worth it, you know? So here we go. 600 damage. I'm just gonna be careful, because I'm actually kind of scared for Shangarama to do a little too much damage and just kick this guy butt. Like, imagine if you get a, like, a super critical damage on Leviumon, he'll be dead. And we just got a crits. Oh man. I was talking about crits and we got a crits. Oh my god, I'm scared guys, I'm really scared right now, because I knew we were going to defeat this guy. But I'm just scared that we're just going to defeat him with Shangreymon. Uh, rise, uh, yeah, yeah, Shangreymon, alright. Let's see. Please do not crits. Ooh, I wasn't expecting Levimon to speak. I kind of like his voice. It's kind of weird, but I kind of like it. Alright, please do not kill him. Do not kill him. Alright, as much as I will not mind about it, but we already... Okay, 7,000 to... Holy crap! We did a lot of damage right here, guys, so we did more than I expected. Alright, here we go. And we were so close to defeat him with this move. Alright. Oh, damn it. Shall I let this guy or not? Okay, I'm just gonna let this guy. Alright. All right, I'm just gonna guard. Give more speed to this little Falcomon. I mean, you know, this guy. Here we go. Come on now. It's your turn. Finish him off! I need you to do so because basically I want you to get this requirement. Damn it, man! You need to do more damage, but you don't. I could actually give him an item so he could do more damage, but I don't know. I'm not doing it right now. Oh no! <laughs> I'm so dumb! <laughs> what did I do this right now? Alright, love you, man. You're a little faster. I think that's so dumb that we can do this. Like, what the swag? Why can't we do this? Alright, here we go. Alright, so Atlas is gonna be more strong, man. It's your turn now. Alright, thank you. Alright, it's over now. Our attack is doubled. Fire Joel! Here we go. Let's go. Adios, my friend. Leviamon's sin is envy. It's a difficult feeling that doesn't go away easily. The last child! Everything's alright now. Don't worry. What? Like, you're gonna have one and I can't! Cell phones! Comics! CDs! Clothes! All I'm supposed to do is study. She's so lucky. I want Kana's parents to be my parents also. Envy towards friends. So that's why this child was chosen to be material. Stupid. There are some people who can't see their parents even though they want to. Don't say you want someone's parents to be yours. That's just sad. Agumon. A code key. It's the code key of envy. Kagura. It looks like we've managed to rescue all the missing children. Kagura, it's dangerous. You might be attacked by Digimon. I can't just sit around and do nothing. All right, I'll take the code key of envy as evidence. Hey, wait a minute. It's that private investigator again. You've got some nerve. Hey now, I'm not here to cause trouble. I've been double-crossed by my client. Isn't that right, Kagura? Huh. Hello, did someone drop you on your head as a baby? I don't like getting angry, but... I have no idea what you're talking about. I don't even know you. In that case, take a look at this. This light! 
<laughs> when I sent the two code keys I stole to my client, I tracked the data I sent using a tracking program virus. <gasps> my client's attitude was quite annoying to me. Now, I want an explanation. Why do you have the two code keys that I gave to my client? Into your pockets, Kagura. Thomas, hey, what are you doing? Hey, Thomas, you don't actually believe what this guy is saying. I don't. However, we need to know what's in Kagura's pockets. Say something, Kagura. Don't just stand there. investigator to draw dad's attention away from me but it looks like my actions have come back to haunt me that's <laughs> they're the code keys for sloth and green i hired him to steal them why are you doing this <laughs> Sloth, greed. I don't understand, Kagura. Why? Look at yourself. Look at what you're becoming. If Yuma saw you like this... Yuma? <laughs> Fools. I'm the one who sacrificed the children and Yuma as material for the Mao. Huh? I used the evil Digimon to find the children that would make good material for the Mao. I activated the Mao Digimon data in the dark area. I used Dax and that moron to retrieve the code keys the Mao Digimon were carrying. For what purpose? To gather all six code keys and unlock the last seal in the dark area. The Lord of Darkness is frozen in the dark area. The most powerful Digimon ever! I intend to unlock the seal to the Cho Mao Digimon! Cho Mao? There's no reason for me to explain myself anymore. You're all going to die here. We've got company! Step out of it! Let's get it together! Why? Why, Kagura? Alright, so why did Kagura betray us? Why did he really do this, man? This guy's so dummy. There's no point of doing that, man. This guy's crazy, guys. But anyway... Oh my god, I wasn't expecting 2 Demon Vimon plus 2 Demon Vimon. But we actually gotta destroy this guy, man. Just because of what Kagura is doing, man, is so bad. And we can't let him do this, man. Here we go. One down already. That was easy, guys. So, so easy. And also, if we go back in this area, we can get a chest, as you've seen, before we get into the cutscene, like the first cutscene. So, just so you guys know, because I'm actually not gonna go get it right at the moment, because I don't see the point. It's just for a chest, so. If I need it, then I know that there's one here, guys, and y'all know as well, so, you know, I think it's cool with that. Alright, so now we just need to defeat those two guys now, those two Devimon. So, they're gonna be easy, because, yo, Shangroman still have an attack, and Shangroman is so strong, man. You see how much damage he did in this last battle, guys? I was crazy how strong he is. Alright, so, Shangroman, show me what you made of, my friend. Just destroy this Devimon. I knew you can do it. Come on. Glorious Burst! And here we go, man. That's what I'm talking about, Shangrimon. Alright, so now we just need to defeat this little Divimon. I believe it's this turn now, right? Yeah. He's gonna get this turn next turn anyway. So, Dead Cloud, just do as you please. It's not gonna stop me. That did zero damage, man. Kagura, you're really, really bad, my friend. Your Digimon are bad. I, I had to say it, because he's a bad guy. So, that's why I'm saying his Digimon are bad. Alright, so that does nothing. But it doesn't matter. Because next turn, it should be over, guys. I mean, I hope so. I mean, not this turn, but I guess Shangramon's turn. Alright, Holland Canyon. Oh, snap. 648 damage. That's good. Let's go. Let's talk about that. Alright, let's go. Finish this battle now, Shangramon. Let's go. So, it seems like we still haven't uh, killed enough Mega Digimon for our friend. So, I guess the next Mega Digimon that we're defeating, guys, we're going to defeat. We're going to get another Mega, hopefully. But anyway, maybe we do have the requirements. Maybe I just need to fight those per Digimon. But anyways, here we go. Where's 
Kagura! He escaped. What a fraud. I can't believe he's planning to resurrect such a dangerous Digimon like a Choma. <clears throat> Creepymon? Let's get back to Dad's. We've got to inform Commander Samson about Kagura. We need to devise a plan. Kagura! Why? Huh? What? An earthquake? Code key of slot. Yes! Soon, soon the power of the Chomau Digimon will be mine! Even that genius Thomas H. Norstein is a simpleton compared to me. With the Chomau Digimon serving me, I'll be the greatest Digimon tamer of all time! <laughs> the children into the digital world. He was using them to resurrect the Mao Digimon resting in the dark area. Even Yuma! He hired me to make Dad's focus on me, instead of him. Kagura intends to collect all the code keys and break the last seal, to resurrect the Cho Mao Digimon frozen in the dark area. That's Kagura's objective. Cho Mao Digimon? Commander, we've detected a huge Digimon signature. We speculate it's probably a Mao Digimon. Six code keys. That's what Kagura was saying. Right now, Kagura is holding five code keys. So the next code key will make a total of six? We don't have much time. Get out there and find it!